Hi everyone, I'm super excited to be here to give you a very first, very exclusive look at our brand new feature, the Spot Me Studio. With Studio, you'll be able to create professional live video streams and live virtual events using just Backstage. With Studio, we're bringing video conferencing, video branding capabilities and live interactive options into a single place backstage. This way you won't have to use Zoom, OBS, StreamYard or any other tool to create your live stream. So let's go ahead and take a look. So to get started, you'll have to create a live streaming backstage just as you do now. So let's call it a studio first look. And you'll just have to select SpotMe Studio as a streaming provider. You'll still have the options of using SpotMe Streaming to get RTMPs, RTMPS credentials or a third party provider. But so we'll default to SpotMe Studio, we'll leave that on. And of course it's a SpotMe product, so you'll be able to use clapping, who's watching, Q&A, live interpretation and other features that we'll be releasing in the future. So again, give it a name, schedule your studio session and click save. And now you are in the what we call a studio room. So the room is not open yet, uh, but let's take just a quick look at what's here. So at the top we have a couple of settings we can change uh, like before, uh, we can download some reports and we can see some quick stats, uh, streaming time, number of viewers, and number of claps. Uh, these all are going to be visible once you go live. On the right hand side, there's the Q&A, so you'll be able to uh, see the incoming questions, approve them or archive them if they don't fit a topic, and you'll be also able to post announcements from here. So the new thing here is obviously this big space in the middle where I'm being asked to uh, open the room. So I'm just going to click that and what's going to happen now is we are actually creating a video conference here. So you can see my uh, preview here at the bottom and again think of the studio as a video conferencing plus video editing plus live interactivity tool. So right now uh, you can see the interactivity here, the video conferencing here and the video editing is going to be also visible here in the future. This is the live preview of your live stream. There's nothing going on right now, so that's why it's black. Um, and what we have is also this new speakers panel. I see my little thumbnail uh, from my webcam. I can see I'm muted and I have a couple of controls here. I can change my microphone. Uh, I can change my webcam. I can share a screen. And the most exciting thing I can do is actually I can invite other people. I can invite other speakers to join my uh, studio room. To do that, I can click on this button and then I get this a link that I can copy paste. I can send it over email to my speakers or I can send it in a calendar invite just as I would do with a Zoom or a WebEx meeting. Again, this is sort of like a video conferencing uh, room with some extra features. So I'm going to copy this link and I'm going to invite my friend here uh, and here they are. The speaker Smurp uh, has joined the session. And what they can do now as a speaker, uh, they see a very similar interface like mine. Let me actually show it to you. Um, and so they see me here again as another person uh, and they have just a couple of less options. So they can only leave the room, they cannot go live and they cannot control other speakers. Uh, the thing they can do also is uh, share a screen. So let me select a window here. Um, that uh, I will be sharing um, and they can of course see the Q&A, they can see only approved questions, they cannot moderate or see questions that are not ready yet for them. So let's move on to my view as a host. Now to actually start my live stream, what I would do is I can add the speakers onto the live stream, I just click this little plus button here and I can add a speaker smurf uh, here as well. Um, it takes a couple of seconds and you see uh, we can uh, now talk and we could go live and broadcast this to participants. Uh, of course I can also add a speakers uh, screen share here and they can go through their slides and do the presentation. Um, uh, I can of course pull speakers out from the live stream 
so I can remove myself and then my video is not going to be visible on the screen anymore. I can also uh, still unmute myself and I can talk even though if I'm not on the video, I would thought it's gonna be a very cool feature. And uh, of course I can remove the screen share and other things. So um, that's a very quick look at uh, Spot Me Studio of how it looks, uh, looks like today and the features it has. Uh, we'll be releasing the studio very soon to our Spot Me Anywhere customers. So you'll be able to use it to run your uh, virtual events actually on your own. Um, and there's a couple of other things that we are still working on that we'll be adding to the studio. Uh, we'll be adding a speaker chat. So you'll be able to um, talk to other speakers as a host or speakers between themselves before they go live. So you can coordinate you know, who's next, uh, who's delayed or to switch slides, etc. And uh, we'll be adding, of course, the polling. So you'll be able to um, create and run polls from the same screen. Uh, from uh, this uh, Q&A panel, we'll be also adding a polling panel. So we'll be able to you know, have exactly just one screen where you can run your live virtual events and your live streams and make them really engaging. And then the last thing uh, that we'll be adding is uh, branding and media controls. So you can see already here, I have this black border around my video. You'll be able to customize this background and upload a custom uh, picture so to customize it to be up to your brand and you'll be able to upload pre-recorded videos uh, that you may want to play as intro outro ads uh, or other kind of short videos and then we'll be looking into extending that into helping you produce similar live uh, sessions so you can play a pre-recorded session of uh, 40 minutes and then at the end joining live as a Q&A so all of that is coming soon, as I said, uh, stay tuned. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, feedback, feel free to leave a comment below in the comment section on our YouTube video. Uh, do not forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.